This is Justin with Wolf Brand Scooters, and today we're going to show you how to do a valve adjustment. The first step is to remove the 10mm bolts holding the seat bucket in place, along with the screws holding the plastic piece in front of the seat bucket. Step 2 is to remove the 8mm bolts holding the valve cover to the cylinder head. Step 3 is to turn the flywheel to the top dead center mark, making sure the large hole on the camshaft is facing away from the cylinder and perfectly in the middle of the exhaust and intake valve. Step 4 is to check the clearance of the valves with the feeler gauge. When adjusting the valve clearance, use a 9mm socket to loosen the tappet nut, sliding the feeler gauge in between the tappet and the valve. The specs for the valve clearance is 3 thousandths of an inch on the intake and 4 thousandths of an inch on the exhaust. Step 5 is to rotate the crankshaft making sure everything is working properly. Step 6 is to reinstall the valve cover making sure the valve cover gasket is free of debris. The last step is to install all the plastics back onto the scooter. This has been Justin at Wolf Brand Scooters, and that's how you do a valve adjustment.